I'm Jeff Briggs from NASA Glenn Research Center in Cleveland, Ohio. And I'm an aerospace engineer working on the space flight program for NASA. We're here at Cedar Point Amusement Park in Sandusky, Ohio for Math and Science Week. This is when students from all over the Midwest come here to learn about some of the ways that math and science are used in everyday life. And they get to have some fun and ride the rides as well. I actually got to come here when I was in high school to go to physics day and ended up with a graduate degree in physics. So obviously they're doing something right. Amusement parks are a great place to learn about some of the ways that the equations you learn in the classroom are used in real life. For example, if you look at the power tower behind me here, some of the things the riders experience are microgravity and g-forces. These are things that engineers in the spaceflight program use every day in their jobs. So let's take a ride and find out for ourselves. Come on. So, here we are in the power tower. The power tower was built in 1998 for $10 million. And since it's been opened, 15 million people have ridden it. Uh, I think it gives about 1 million rides every summer. So the power tower is about 300 feet tall. And I'm going to be launched straight up at 50 miles an hour to a height of 240 feet. Thank you, sir. So what we're going to experience in this ride is what's called G-forces. So I'm going to get shot up and experience about four G-forces. This means I'm going to feel four times heavier than I would in normal gravity. This is really close to the same thing that happens to astronauts when they're launched up on a rocket. Except on the rocket launch, I think it's about two to three G-forces. So this is the same feeling as you get when you're uh, in the car and someone hits the gas and you get pushed back in your seat. So I'm going to get slammed right down to my seat as soon as we get launched up. So, I think we're about ready to go. All right, here we go. Woo! Now, on the way back down, we're going to experience just the opposite of G-forces. This is called microgravity, and you're going to feel lighter than you would under normal gravity. So when I got fallen down, I was falling down at the same rate as this ride and got launched out of my seat. This is the same thing that astronauts feel when they're up on the space station, except in my case, I'm falling down toward the Earth, and astronauts in the space station are falling down around the Earth and the astronauts are falling around at the same rate as the space station. So when you see astronauts on the space station, they're floating around in the air like they don't weigh anything, which is what happens in microgravity. So, hope you're having a good day, and maybe sometime you can try this at your local amusement park.